All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right, staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you were safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep finding a good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you. And that the Messiah intercedes for you. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciate it. Take it one day at a time. Amen, y'all. Let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another chance to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes on our back, and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us and guiding us coming in and going out. Guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, getting us through the evening, getting us through the night. Constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God. Always looking out for us all the time, y'all. With his protection, his word, his only begotten son died for our sins. Got angels assigned to us, protecting us. Just so much things the Lord continues to keep doing for us and always will keep doing because his mercy endures forever. And he keeps his people, he protects his pro- he, he protects his people, he keeps his promises, amen. So there's always something to thank the Lord about, y'all. There's always testimonies we got to tell and share, you know. So always thank him and praise him, hallelujah. Most definitely, y'all. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening and support. It means a lot to me. I love you all. I'm praying for you all. Let's always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let's always pray for each other, comfort one another, support each other, intercede for each other, all those things, y'all. We need that unity, that peace, that harmony, that love, that togetherness, that gathering. We always need that, you know. So much going on to many believers out there in the world and many non-believers as well. So hopefully they could be converts as well. So God keep reaching out to people day by day. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth, all the scattered Israelites into all ends of the earth. Much love to the churches and ministries out there doing their thing. Much love to all the brave, courageous people out there, the martyrs, the ones who are getting in prison for the gospel, those who are being persecuted, what have you. Uh, much love to all you believers out there who are fighting the good fight. And much love to all the great tribulation of saints. Much love to all the engrafted Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kindreds, all over the world. Appreciate all of you. Any brand new converts, God bless you too. Anyone who just gave life to Christ, anyone who just got baptized, who just became a believer, God bless you as well. Welcome, most definitely, y'all. Welcome everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faiths, all kindreds, everybody, all brothers and sisters of the faith, all of you. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. All the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fish in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Hallelujah. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted and grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the Lord. Sing a new song, clap our hands, stomp our feet, praise him. Rejoice, always rejoice. Make a joyful noise, make a joyful sound. Constantly clap your hands, play an instrument, express yourself, cry out to him. Do what you got to do, y'all. Always serve him with gladness and joy and always worship in spirit and truth. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God with all your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God with all your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. And let's keep doing Father's business and Father's will for us of our lives till the sun comes back. Amen. He is coming back like a thief in the night. He is coming in a twinkling of an eye. He is coming back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. So let's stay ready, alert, sober, vigilant. Watchful, pray it up. Keep on working, people. Keep the commandments. Keep the faith. Keep your lamps and your oils. Let's keep being washed by the water through the word, by the washing of the water, by the word, people. Let us be on point on this narrow path forevermore. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Let the Lord keep revealing himself to us more often. Let the Lord keep giving us dreams, visions, encounters. Let's get more close to the Lord. Let's get more. Just constantly seek his face. Let us know him better. Draw near to God and he will draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey the law, statute, commandments. Let us obey the gospel. All of God's word, anything the most has told you personally, according to your life, your purpose, your calling, your situation, your gifts, your talents, your assignments, your task, handle that, people. All right, let's be more responsible. Let's be more sharp. Let's be more diligent. Let's be more reasonable and practical. Let's make more sense. All right, let's be more better uh, stewards, better managers, better resp- more responsible people, man. Got to be more mature, more responsible with what the most high gives us. Okay, whatever God gives us, let's use it for his kingdom. Okay. Use what God gave you, people, okay? Let's be better listeners and more obedient to what the Father is showing us and telling us through our situations, amen? Most definitely, y'all. All right, all right, all right. Hope y'all staying strong and good out there, okay? So 
Today, we will go through today's Bible reading, and then we will go through with recommended reading scriptures, and we will go through this commentary, okay? And then from there, we will close out with a prayer, we will close out with a priestly blessing, and we will close out giving all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and praise his only begotten Son, die for our sins, amen? Hallelujah. So today's Bible reading will be the book of Job, chapter 31, in its whole entirety, okay? Job, chapter 31, verses 1 through 40, all the way through, okay? So here we go, today's Bible reading, Job. 31. I made a covenant with my eyes not to look lustfully at a woman. For what is a man's lot from God above? His heritage from the Almighty on high. Is it not ruin for the wicked? Disaster for those who do wrong? Does he not see my ways and count my every step? If I have walked in falsehood or my foot has heard after deceit, let God weigh me in honest scales, and he will know that I am blameless. If my steps have turned from the path, if my heart has been led by my eyes, or if my eyes, or if my hands have been defiled, then may others eat what I have sown, and may may my crops be uprooted. If my heart has been enticed by a woman, or if I have lurked at my neighbor's door, then my wife grind another man's grain, and may other men sleep with her, for that would have been shameful, a sin to be judged. It is a fire that burns to destruction. It would have uprooted my harvest. If I have denied justice to my men, my men servants and maid servants, when they had a grievance against me, what will I do when God confronts me? Hmm. What will I answer when I'm called to account? Did not he who made me in the womb make them? Did not the same one form us both within our mothers? If I have denied the desires of the poor or let the eyes of the widow grow weary, if I have kept my bread to myself, not sharing it with the fatherless, but from my youth, I reared him as a as would a father. And from my birth, I guided the widow. If I have seen anyone perishing for lack of clothing or a needy man without a garment and his heart did not bless me for warming him with the fleece from my sheep. If I have raised my hand against the fatherless, knowing that I had influence in court, then let my arm fall from the shoulder. Let it be broken off at the joint. For I dreaded destruction from God, and for, for and for fear of his splendor, I cannot do such things. If I have put my trust in gold, or set to pure gold, you are my security. If I have rejoiced over my great wealth, the fortune my hands gained. If I have regarded the sun in its radiance, or the moon moving in splendor, so that my heart was secretly enticed, and my hand offered them a kiss of homage, then these also would be sins to be judged, for I would have been unfaithful to God on high. If I have rejoiced at my enemy's misfortune or gloated over the trouble that came to him, have not allowed my mouth to sin. I have not allowed my mouth to sin by invoking a curse against his life. If the men of my household have never said, who has not had his fill of Job's food, of Job's food, but no stranger had to spend the night in the street. For my door was always open to the traveler. If I have concealed my sin as men do, by hiding my guilt in my heart, because I so feared the crowd and so dreaded the contempt of the clan of the tribes that I kept silent and would not go outside. Oh, that I had someone to hear me. I sound now, I sign now my defense. Let the Almighty answer me. Let my accuser put his indictment in writing. Surely I would wear it on my shoulder. I would put it on like a crown. I would give him an account of my every step. Like a prince, I would approach him. If my land cries out against me and all its furrows are wet with tears, if I have devoured its yield without payment or broken the spirit of its tenants, then let briars come up instead of wheat and weeds instead of barley. The words of Job are ended. All right. Amen. That's the book of Job chapter 31 right there in its whole entirety. Love all the poetry and pouring out your heart, crying out and acknowledging God and just all that. You know, that type of awareness is always amazing to constantly seek God and humble ourselves to see all the things we'd be doing on our daily basis and to evaluate what we're doing and how we're presented before God, you know, how God sees it, how God sees all and what have you, you know. So I just love reading the book of Job. So much less as you can get out of it that we could apply to our lives. Amen. So that's today's Bible reading, okay? Now what I would like to do is get into the recommended reading scriptures, okay? So the first recommended reading scripture is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 18, verses 1 through 10. Jeremiah 18, chapter 18, verses 1 through 10. At the potter's house. This is the word that came to Jeremiah from the Lord. Go down to the potter's house, and there I will give you my message. So I went down to the potter's house, and I saw him working at the wheel. But the pot was shaping form, shaping from the clay, was marred in his hands. So the potter formed it into another pot, shaping it as seemed best to him. 
Then the word of the Lord came to me, O house of Israel, can I do can I not do with you as this potter does? declares the Lord, like clay in the hand of the potter, so are you in my hand, O house of Israel. If at any time I announce that a nation or kingdom is to be uprooted, torn down, and destroyed, and if that nation I warn repents of its evil, then I will relent and not afflict on it the disaster I had planned. And if at another time I announce that a nation or kingdom is to be built up and planted, and if it does and if it does evil in my sight and does not obey me, then I will reconsider the good I had intended to do for it. All right. Wow. That is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 18, verses 1 through 10. You know, very interesting. I love that. That's a very powerful read right there. It shows how when a nation or a people are able to repent from their ways, how God will turn away what he was about to do to them. You know, but when they get their warning and people don't turn away from them, how God will destroy them or plant some or put a plague on them or something, you know. We see uh, various sides of God when it comes to his anger, his wrath, his vengeance, things like that. But we see the merciful side of him, how, how he actually sends warnings, you know what I mean? But um, repentance is very important, man. Turn from our ways is very important for all of us individually and as a whole, you know what I mean? And um, I love how God tells Jeremiah how he has his hands on Israel and how the potter has his hands on the clay, how God got his hands on us, you know, so we got to really stay on the wheel for the most high and uh, go through what he has for us, amen, so fathers, when the father's hands, people, amen, so that's the first recommended reading scripture, okay, the second recommended reading scripture is the book of Joel, chapter 2, verses 25 through 27, all right, the book of Joel, chapter 2, verses 25 through 27, I will restore, I will repay you for the years the locusts have eaten, the great locusts and the young locusts, the other locusts and the locust swarm. My great army that I set among you, you will have plenty, plenty to eat until you are full, and you will praise the name of the Lord your God, who has worked wonders for you. Never again will my people be shamed. Then you will know that I am in Israel, that I am the Lord your God, and that there is no other. Never again will my, will my people be ashamed. Amen. That's the book of Joel, chapter 2, verses 25 through 27. God will restore and make up, you know, he will, he will make it up for us, y'all. A lot of y'all felt like y'all have been going through years or something, and the Most High knows how to restore, man. He definitely knows how to double it, man. He knows how to double and give things abundantly, man. He really does. So whatever you feel lacking in or you feel desperate in or what have you, watch how the Most High uh restores us man watch how he pays it all back to us and doubles it triples it even beyond it you know praise the most high all right so that's the book of joel chapter 2 verses 25 through 27 okay there's a lot of people out there walking around with a, a heavy heart or feel guilty or conscious or something like that um or a little, you know kind of hard on themselves or what have you but you know man we serve a forgiving god man we serve a gracious merciful god man and he, he's he's very huge giving man huge at giving y'all to the Most High God, us, Amen. So the next recommended reading scripture is the Book of Romans, chapter eight, verses eighteen through thirty. Future glory, I consider that our present sufferings are not worthy, not worth comparing with the glory that will be revealed in us. The creation waits in eager expectation for the sons of God to be revealed. For the creation was subjected to frustration. Not by its own choice, but by the will of the one who subjected it in hope that the creation itself will be liberated from its bondage to decay, to decay and brought into the glorious freedom of the children of God. We know that the whole creation has been groaning as in the pains of childbirth right up to the present time. Not only so, but we ourselves who have the first fruits of the spirit groan inwardly as we wait eagerly for our adoption as sons, the redemption of our bodies. For in this hope we were saved, but hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what he already has? Hmm. But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. In the same way the Spirit helps us in our weaknesses, we do not know what we ought to pray for, but the Spirit himself intercedes for us with groans that words cannot express. And he who searches our hearts knows the mind of the Spirit, because the Spirit intercedes for the saints in accordance with God's will more than conquerors and we know that all things work together for good to them that love god to them who are called 
to them who are the called according to his purpose, from whom he did foreknow, he also did predestined to be conformed to the image of his son, that he might be the firstborn among many brethren. Moreover, whom he did predestine, them he also called, and whom he called, them he also justified, and whom he justified, them he also glorified. Hallelujah, amen, hallelujah, amen. Yes, yes, y'all. Love reading Romans chapter 8, man. Very excellent read. All right, so that was the recommended reading scripture, okay? All right, now we will get to the actual commentary itself, okay? The title of this commentary is A Different Type of Deliverance. God doesn't always deliver us from our troubles. Sometimes he, deliver, he delivers us through them. That's a hard truth for us to accept, but it represents a very real dynamic in God's economy. In the midst of his trials, Job struggled to understand why God would allow him to suffer. After all, he had lived a righteous life and didn't deserve the troubles that came his way. Job cried out to God, If I have walked in falsehood or my foot has heard after deceit, let God weigh me in honest scales, and he will know that I am blameless. Verse 5. Most of us have prayed in a similar prayer. One couple went through some tough times financially when the bottom fell out of the stock market causing their solid investments to plummet. They lost nearly everything they invested and struggled to understand why God didn't intervene. In the midst of his painful loss, in the midst of this painful loss, they reminded God, you know, we've been faithful with what you've given us. But the more they prayed, the worse the situation seemed to get. Several years passed before they even began to understand what God wanted them to learn through their season of misfortune. But through their trials, they grew closer to God than ever before. Have you experienced this kind of situation? If you can't think of any instances of your adult life, think about a t- to a time when you were a boy or a young man, young girl, young woman. Quite often we grow up having to deal with, at some point, unjust suffering. Whether the injustice comes from comes on the playground or in a college classroom or an entry-level job, sometimes the frustration of being falsely accused is almost too much to bear. But we can take a lesson from Job. Toward the end of Job's suffering, before God had restored the fortunes Job had lost, he realized that God was teaching him through the trying times. Surely I spoke of things I did not understand. Job admitted to the Lord, things too wonderful for me to know. In Job chapter 42, verse 3. Often when trials become too great for us to bear, God does deliver us from them. But as with Job, sometimes God has a greater purpose to teach us, to draw us closer to himself, or for some other reason we struggle to understand. In these times of trial, he delivers us through our suffering. And when we're faithful, we gain things too wonderful to know. Amen. Things to take away from the commentary. What, fun, what wonderful things did God try to teach Job through his time of trouble? What trials has God brought into your life to mold and shape you? How have you responded to these troubles? If God brings similar trials into your life in the future, how do you think he wants you to respond? Amen, people. Praise the Lord, y'all. People stay strong out there. People stay strong, you know. All this prophecy is being fulfilled right now before our eyes. And um, it's a reason why the Messiah mentioned Noah, Job, Moses, Jeremiah, Daniel, Lot, the prophets, you know, because the Messiah is letting us know that we have to go through similar situations that these men went through before us, you know, and that nobody is above lessons, trials, tribulations, getting humbled, see different seasons, things like that. Of course, obviously, Messiah went through it for all of us all over the world. But, you know, he shed his blood for our sins and everything. So that example the Messiah set for us, us following that narrow path, we have to also deal with things out of our control, you know, but we stay strong at God's word through it all. Amen. So... Stay strong out there, people. I don't know the details of your situation. God knows all the details, and God got you, okay? And, um, you know, it's all prayers up, love, comfort, and interceding on this side, man, for all four corners, amen? So that's the commentary, okay? So what I would love to do as I close out is give all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and praise his only begotten Son who died for our sins, amen? Hallelujah, y'all. So here we go. Hallelujah. I praise the most high God of heaven and earth. Most definitely. He's the God of Shem, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the God of Israel. Most definitely, y'all. He is the God of Israel, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. Most definitely, y'all. His only begotten son died for our sins and rose up three days later, y'all. He is risen, sitting at the right hand of the Father right now to save for us. Amen. The Messiah is also in our hearts. Greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. Hallelujah. Praise the Messiah forever. Most definitely, y'all. Praise the most high God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. Praise the most high God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Hallelujah. Praise the most high forever, y'all. His son is the last Adam, the second Adam. 
Praise the Most High, y'all, the Advocate, the Almighty, True Living God, the Alpha and Omega, Amen. The Apostle of our profession, the Arm of the Lord, the Atonement Sacrifice for our sins, the Author and Finisher of our faith, the Author and Perfecter of our faith, the Author of life, the Author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the Beloved Son. The blessed only potent, the blessed only ruler, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the constellation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, the eternal life, the everlasting father, the faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness. The first and last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born over all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, Jehovah, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Shalom, Jehovah Nassai. Je Jehovah Nassai, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, king eternal. He is a king of Israel. Amen. He is a king of kings. Hallelujah. He is a king of kings, the Lord of lords. Hosanna, son of David. Hosanna, the highest praise. Sing king of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader and commander, the life, the life, the world, the light of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord. The Lord is my banner. The Lord is holiness. The Lord, our righteousness. The Lord is my shepherd. The Lord is my rock. The Lord is my deliverer. The Lord is my shield, my buckler. The Lord is my provider, my healer, my redeemer, my salvation. Most definitely the good fortress, the high tower, our refuge. Praise the most high forever, y'all. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Shai, Yahweh, Be Yahweh, Yahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehoah, Ahai, Yeshaya, Yahuwah, Adonai. He is a consuming fire. He is the father of lights, the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician who can heal all things. He is the carpenter who can fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rest on the seventh day. He can fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch the great, y'all. Call on him. He'll show you great, mighty things, y'all. Search and seek him with all of your heart and you will find him, y'all. You got It is impossible. Please God without faith, y'all. So. Gotta believe in him, gotta trust in him, y'all. He is a reward to those who seek him diligently, y'all. Gotta believe in him, y'all. Gotta trust in him, people. Faith without works is dead, people. The just shall live by faith. We walk by faith and not by sight. Your faith made you well, your faith saved you, people. Most definitely, y'all. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracle signs, wonders. We know for sure that the mighty hand of God is going to be in our lives for the rest of our lives. We know that the finger of God is going to be in our lives for the rest of our lives. We know that the outstretched arm of God is going to be in our lives for the rest of our lives. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. We are in agreement with the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, y'all. Most definitely, y'all. The Most High is going to keep looking out for us, y'all. He's going to do it. I'm telling y'all, man. You got to hang in there. Be strong and patient. His timing is perfect diamond, perfect timing, due timing, perfect timing, y'all. So, be still and know that he is God. Amen. Stay strong, people. Stay patient, people. Praise him, y'all. Praise him, praise him, praise him. He is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator of the new, the message of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God and Savior, our holiness, our spiritual husband, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrificed Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection and life, the resurrection, the resurrected, or life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the ruler of God's creation, the ruler of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man. Son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone the builders rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. Yes, he's the truth. Amen. He is the way. Hallelujah. He is the way, truth, and life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Yahuwah, the true word, y'all, most definitely forever. We know that his word is a double-edged sword, the book of Hebrews says. We know that his word is purified. So just as David said in Psalms, so we know that every word of God is true, pure, and flawless, as the book of Proverbs says. Amen. Most definitely. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but God's words are forever. Hallelujah. Praise him, people. Hallelujah. In the midst of your situation, everything you going on, got going on in your life, y'all, always got to keep in mind how excellent the Messiah is and what he's done for all of us, y'all, how his blood was shed for all over the world. 
He died for our sins, people. All of our sins, transgressions, iniquities, wrongdoings, man, his blood paid for it, y'all. Most understand that all authority from heaven and earth has been given to him, okay? He intercedes for us right now. We understand that, you know, he's the name above all names, y'all, and that every tongue shall confess who he is, every knee shall bow before him, hallelujah. So we just know forevermore who he is and what he's done for us. He told us to cheer up because he told us the world over. He, he told us that the world does give us trouble. He told us to cheer up because he overcame the world, amen. So we are more to conquer through him who loved us, hallelujah. He is the Lord Jesus Christ. He is the Lord of all. He is the abiding son, abolish of the enemy, abundant grace, abundant life, ancient of days, Adonai, advocate, Aleph and Ta'u, Alpha and Omega, altogether lovely, amen. Anchor of souls, angel of God, angel of his presence, angel of Jacob, angel of the Lord, anointed king, anointed one, anointed of the Holy Spirit, anointed preacher, anointed witness, anointed of my head, another king, another priest, anthem of a new song, apple tree, appointed heir, appointed judge, appointed of God, Appointed sacrifice, appointer of seasons, approved of God, ark of strength, arm of his strength, arm of redemption, arm of the Lord, armor of God, assurance of our hearts, a stonied one, Arthur and finisher of our faith, Arthur of eternal salvation, arrow of conviction, Arthur of peace with God, Arthur of the book of life, availing shield and buckler, baby of Bethlehem, baby and child of promise, balm of Gilead, banner of Israel, banner of love, baptizer, bearer of the seven stars, beautiful and glorious branch, beauty of holiness, beauty of the Lord beginning and ending, beginning of wisdom, beloved, white and ruddy one, beloved, white and ruddy one, beloved of the father, beloved son, better than angels, blessed and glorious lamb, blessed and only potent, blessed and glorious name, blessed lamb of glory, blessed one, blessed rock, blessed of the children, branch, branch of righteousness, bread, bread of heaven, bread of God, bread of life, breastplate of our righteousness, bridegroom, bridegroom lamb, bright light of glory, brightness of his glory, brightness of the Lord, brightness of thy rising, bringer of good things, brother of James, buckler to the upright, buckler to all, builder and maker, builder of the church, bruised and afflicted of God, bruiser of Satan, captain of salvation, captain of the Lord's host, carpenter, carpenter Jesus, carpenter's son, chief cornerstone, chief shepherd, chiefest among 10,000, child of Jesus, child of the Holy Spirit, chosen of God, chosen stone of God, Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus the Lord, Christ of God, Christ our life, Christ our peace, Christ the crucified, Christ the King of Israel, Christ the Lord, Christ the rock, Christ the son of David, Christ the son of God, Christ the son of the blessed, Christ the first fruits, cloud of the Lord, cluster of the campfire, comfort of the mourners, comforter of Zion, compassionate shepherd, consuming fire, confidence, conquering lamb, consecrated son, constellation of Israel, complete controller of all, completer of the saints, contradiction of sinners, counsel of the most high, covenant of the people, covenant of promise, convert from the storm, creator of Israel, creator of the new heavens and earth, creator of the principalities and powers, creator of the earth, creator of the heavens, creator of visible and invisible things, creator of the winds, crown of glory, crown of pure gold, darling, days man, days made from on high, Day star, defense, deliver, deliver to Zion, deliver of my soul, desire of the universe, desire of all nations, desire of our soul, desire of the bride, desire of the prophets and kings, desire of the righteous, desire of women, despised and rejected one, despised of the people, do of youth, do unto Israel, diadem of beauty, disallowed storm. Disallowed stone, door of faith, door of the sheep, dwell of the heavenlies, El Shaddai, enlarge of God, elect of the Lord, Elohim, enlarge of my heart, enlighten of my darkness, ensign, ensign for the nations, ensign of the people, enthroned priest, equal of God, establish of the ends of the earth, eternal Christ, eternal life, eternal word, Eucharist of our faith, everlasting God, everlasting King, everlasting name, everlasting priest, ever living intercessor, ever living one, ever merciful one, exalted and exalt, ex ex exalted an extolled servant, exalted God of salvation, exalted lamb, exalted name, exceeding joy our God, our great exceeding sure reward, excellency of God, excellent, excellent and comely one, executor of judgment, executor of righteousness, expectation of David, express image, eye of the Lord, face of God, face of the Lord, fairer than children of man, faithful, faithful ambassador, faithful creator, faithful Lord, faithful and just forgiver, faithful witness, faithfulness, Father of the fatherless, fellow, first and last, first begotten, first begotten from the dead, fire of Zion, firstborn, firstborn among many brethren, firstborn from the dead, firstborn of every creature, firstborn son, first fruit to them, first fruit to them that slept, first love, excellence of God, foreordained eternally, forerunner, former of all things, former of Jacob and Israel, former of the light, fountain of Jacob, fountain of the house of David, framer of the worlds, free gift, friend, friend forever, friend of Abraham, friend of public and sinners, fruit of the earth, fruit of the womb, fullness of the father, fullness of the Godhead, garden of earth, gather the winds, Gentiles trust, gift of God, giver of secrets and treasures of earth, giver of the good spirit, giver of the Holy Spirit, 
abundant giver, gladness of the nations, glorious arm, glorious honor of thy majesty, glorious Lord, glorious voice with us, glory of God's majesty, glory of Israel, glory of the Gentiles, God blessed forever, God manifest in flesh, God of David, God of great kindness, God of pardon and new life, God of righteousness and wrath, God of just run. God, our Savior, God is with us, God with us, good and upright, good Lord, good shepherd, good teacher, good man of the house, governor, governor of many nations, gracious God, gracious Lord, gracious and full of compassion, great counselor, great door, great God, great high priest, great king, great Lord, great one, great peace, great prophet, great Savior, great shepherd, great and amazing, awesome, excellent, wonderful God, greater than Abraham, greater than Isaac, greater than Jacob, greater than Jonah, greater than David, greater than Noah, greater than Solomon, greater than our hearts, greater and more perfect tabernacle, greatness of excellency, Greatness of might, greatness of strength, greatness of thy power, greatness of Zion, green tree, guarantor of our security, guarantor of the new covenant, guarantor of the tree of life, guide for us, hand of the Lord, hang the redeemer, harmless, hated one, hater of iniquity, head above all, head of all principality and powers, head of every man. Head of the body, head of the corner, head of the church, head over all, head over things, healer, healer of broken hearts, healer of souls, healer of wounds, health of my countenance, hear of prayer, help of his countenance, help of the helpless, heir of all things, hidden God, hidden manna, high above all, high and lofty one, high God, high Lord, high priest of good things, high priest of our profession, high priest over house of God, high right hand, high tower of mine, higher than heavens, higher than kings, highest one, his brightness, his dear son, his excellent greatness, his holiness, his holy arm, his loving kindness, his mighty hand, his right hand, his son, Jesus Christ, his son, our Lord, holier than thou, holy and true, holy child, Jesus, holy Lord God, holy name, holy one, holy one and just, holy one of God, holy one of Israel. Holy One of Jacob, Holy One of Mount Paran, Holy Thing, Honorable Lamb of Glory, Honored Son, Hope in a Day of Evil, Hope of David, Hope of Eternal Life, Hope of Glory, Hope of His People Israel, Hope of Israel, Hope of Righteousness, Hope of the Promise, Hope and Joy of Abraham, Hope and Joy of Simeon, Horn of David, Horn of Salvation, Horn of the House of David, Horn of the House of Israel, Horn of My Salvation, Hosanna of the Highest Praise, Hosanna the Son of David, Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord, we have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. House of defense, humble of the high-minded, husband of Israel, husband of the bride. I am, I am that I am, I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, image of the believers, image of the Father, image of the invisible God, Emmanuel, immortal, incarnate God, inf infinite one, inherit of all nations, inherit of my mountains, intercessor of sinners, jasper and sardine stone, jealous God, Jesus, Jesus Christ, our Lord, Jesus Christ, our Savior, Jesus Christ, the righteous, Jesus of Galilee, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the crucified, Jesus, the grace and truth, Jesus, the king of the Jews, Jew, judge, judge among nations, judge of all the earth, judge of Israel, judge of quick and dead, judge of the fatherless, judge of widows, justified of the spirit, justified of the circumcision, justified of the seed of Israel, just God, just Lord, just man, just one, just savior, keeper of Israel, keeper of the covenant and mercy, keeper of the keys of hell and death, kindler of Tophet, king beautiful, king eternal, king forever, king of all the earth, king of glory, king of heaven, king of Israel, king of Jacob, king of kings, the Lord of lords, king of nations, king of peace, king of righteousness, king of saints, king of the Jews. King of truth, King of Zion, Kesman near than I, Kesman redeemer, Kodashem, holy one, Korban, sacrifices, Lamb, Lamb of God, Lamb of Mount Zion, Lamb of the 144,000 sealed Israelites of the 12 tribes of Israel, Lamb of the first fruits, Lamb of the Israelites, Lamb of salvation, Lamb of the great multitude, Lamb of the 12 apostles, Lamb slain from the foundation, Lamb to the slaughter, Lamb without spot and blemish, Lamp, Lamp of the feet, last Adam, leader and commander, life, life of man, lifted and exalted son, lifted up suffering symbol, lifted up my head, light and truth, light everlasting, light in darkness, light of heaven, light of Israel, light of life, light of men, light of the city, light of the Gentiles, light of the glorious gospel, light Light of the glory of God, light of the path, light of the world, light of thy countenance, lily among thorns, lily of the valley, lion of the tribe of Judah, lion of Zion, living bread, living redeemer, living savior, living stone, long suffering God, Lord and Christ, Lord and God, Lord and shepherd, Lord from heaven. Lord God, the holy prophets, Lord of God of Mount Sinai, Lord God of Mount Sinai, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord of glory, Lord Messiah, Lord most high, Lord, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, Ahiah Shai, Yeshua Hamashiach, Yahuwah, everlasting strength, Lord of a new covenant, Lord of all, Lord of David, Lord of glory, Lord of heaven and earth, Lord of hosts, Lord of kings, Lord of lords, Lord of peace, Lord of heaven's riches, Lord of the harvest, Lord of the Sabbath, Lord of the scriptures, Lord of the second advent. Lord of the whole earth, Lord, our hope, Lord, our judge, Lord, our king, Lord, our Lord, Lord, our maker, Lord, our righteousness, 
Lord, our shield, Lord, over all, Lord, the God of hosts, Lord, the judge, Lord, thy creator, Lord, thy redeemer, Lord, thy savior, love of righteousness, magnified Lord, magnified name, majesty, maker of all things, maker of Israel, maker of morning darkness, maker of one new man, maker of peace, maker of the new way, maker of the path in the sea, man, Christ Jesus, man of God, man of sorrows, man of thy right hand, man of war, man of from heaven, marred one, married one, marred one, master in heaven, master of the house, master of the sea. Mediator of a better covenant, mediator of the new covenant, mediator of the new testament, mediator between God and man, meek and lowly Jesus, merciful and faithful high priest, merciful God, messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, Messiah the prince, mightier than the mighty waves, mightier than the noise of any waters, mighty and strong one, mighty arm, mighty God, mighty hand of God, mighty man, mighty one of Israel, mighty one of Jacob, mighty power, mighty savior, mighty strength, mighty wisdom, mind of the Lord, mind anointed, mind elect. Mind holy one, minister of the circumcision, minister of the sanctuary, minister of the true tabernacle, most holy, most mighty, most upright, mystery of godliness. God works in mysterious ways. His ways is higher than our ways, his thoughts is higher than our thoughts. Narrow gate, Nazarene, near Lord, obedient son, offspring of David, ointment poured, one, one and only sacrifice, one Lord, one shepherd, only rock, ordained lamp of the anointed, ordained of the Father, ordainer of the preachers, our King, our Lord, our Passover, our peace, our Sabbath, our sin offering, overcome a lamb, Overcomer of the overcomers, overcomer of the principalities, overcomer of the world, overseer of the congregation, pattern of the believers, peacemaker, perfect peace, physician, great physician, excellent physician, wonderful physician, amazing physician, awesome physician, good physician, great physician, pierced Messiah, pierced one, pillar of fire, plant of renown, pleased of the father, polished shaft, portion of Jacob, portion of the land of living, portion of mine inheritance, possessor of heaven and earth. Potent, potter, power of God, powerful and rich lamb, praise of the children, praise of the saints, preacher of good things, preacher of righteousness, precious lamb, precious Lord, precious stone, preeminent one, preparer of heavenly places, preserver of men, preserver of saints, preserver of the word, preserver of the faithful, preserver of his creation, priest, priest forever of Melchizedek, prince of life, prince of princes, prince of the kings of the earth, prophet of his brethren, prophet from Nazareth of Galilee, Prophet, mighty deed and truth, propitiation for sins, propitiation of our faith, proverb to his people, pure one, quickening love, quickening spirit, quickening word, rabbi, rabbani, ransom for all, recompenser, reconciler of enemies, reconciler of things, earthly and heavenly things, redeemer and forgiver, redeemer of Abraham, redeemer of Israel, redeemer of souls, redeemer of the first testament, redeemer of Zion, redeemer of the holy one, redeemer of the lamb, redeemer of the Lord of hosts, redemption, refiner and purifier, Refuge for the oppressed, refuge for us, refuge from the storm, refuge in day of affliction, refuge in trouble, reigning lamb, reproach of men, rest for our souls, restorer of Zion, reject the stone of builders, resurrection and judge, resurrection and a life, revealer of secrets, revealer of counsels of the heart, revealer of the hidden mystery, revealer of the hidden things, re reverend, rewarder of servants and prophets, righteous, righteous and very faithful testimony, right hand of David, right hand of my righteousness, righteous branch, righteous God, righteous judge, righteous man, righteous one, righteous rock, righteous servant. Risen light, risen Lord, river of waters, river of waters, rock higher than I, rock of Israel, rock of my refuge, rock of my salvation, rock of offense, rock of the church, rock of the wilderness, rock and fortress, rock our God, rock the Lord, rod and branch, rod of his mouth, rod of my anger, rod of thy, rod of my strength, rod of thine inheritance, root of David, rose of Sharon, rule of Israel, ruler of the 24 elders, salvation of all nations, salvation of God, salvation of the daughters of Zion. Samaritan, good Samaritan, good helper, good neighbor, help the Samaritan woman, same Lord over all, same stone of prophecy, same yesterday, today, forever, same word of eternity, sanctified and sent one, saving health, saving strength of his anointed, Savior, Savior Jesus, Savior of all, Savior of the body, Savior of the law, Savior of the world, scepter out of Israel, scorned one, search of heart, second man, seeker of thy presence, seed of Abraham, promise, seed of Adam, humanity, seed of David, kingship, seed of God, deity, seed of Jacob, nationality, seed of Judah, tribe, seed of Shem, race, See the woman prophecy, man. We touch and agree, y'all. In the authority and power and name of Jesus Christ, you are healed, renewed, restored, redeemed, forgiven, embraced, loved. New mind, new heart, new soul, new hands to prosper, new footsteps, new path, new journey, new dreams, new vision, new song to sing, new attitude, new outlook, gladness, happiness, joy, wisdom, knowledge, understanding, discernment, and all that. Praise the most high forevermore, y'all. Your past is done. Your old ways are done. Behold, the Lord's doing a new thing. Become a new creature of Christ, y'all. Be born again of spirit of water. Repent and get baptized. Holy Spirit baptism, water baptism. Praise the most high, y'all. Y'all get on that narrow path y'all stay on it, people. Store up your treasures in heaven. Prayers that your name is written in the Lamb's book of life. Prayers that your name is written and recorded in heaven. Prayers that you sit at the table with Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. Prayers that you have the tree of life forever. Prayers that you have everlasting joy. 
Prayers that you're in paradise with God forever. Prayers that you embrace the new heaven, the new earth, the new Jerusalem. Prayers that when it's all said and done, the Messiah looks at you and tells you, well done, good and faithful servant. When he was hungry, you fed him. When he was thirsty, you gave him a drink. When he was in sick, when he was sick or in prison, you checked in, you visited on him. Prayers that you get eternal life in a hundredfold. Prayers that you get the crowns of life, the crown of rejoicing, the crowns of heaven. Prayers that you have the white robes on and you're clothed in the nice garments. Prayers that you have the palm branches and you're singing. Prayers that you're singing and glorified with the Messiah forever. Prayers that you're able to have that everlasting joy, everlasting gladness forevermore, people, most definitely. Amen. Hallelujah. Touch and agree. Prayers that the many matches the Messiah, the Father promise you that you obtain that. Hallelujah. Messiah prepares a place for you, y'all. Come on, y'all. We've got somewhere to go. Praise the Lord, y'all. We have a lot to endure and go through prior to that, okay? So, Stay strong while we're here in this present, okay, people? Because we will have to face the Messiah, and you know it's going to judge us, all right. So let's uh, let's do, let's do let's do better down here with the time we have right now. Give it to us, Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Let us keep the faith, keep the commandments. Let us keep the gospel, keep the testimony of Jesus. All right, people, stay strong and endure as times get more crazy down the road, okay? Do not conform to the ways of the world, all right. Do not take the mark of the beast. Do not worship the image of the beast. Do not fall for the false prophet or the deception of false prophets or false doctrines. Do not follow those false apostles or anything like that. Have discernment, people. Stay stay to the sound doctrine. Stay to the true word. Stay on that narrow path, people. Follow the true Messiah, okay? Prayers up for everybody out there. Don't let nobody take your crown, okay? People, stay strong and endure, people. Endure. Endure it all the way to the end so you can be saved, people. Hallelujah. Praise the most high forevermore, y'all. Prayers up for everybody out there who's listening. Everybody's going through something. All people, man, all over the world, man, all four corners of the earth, all of you, man, prayers up, okay? I don't know the, the, the details of your situation. I don't know what you're facing, what you're battling with, but you're more than a conqueror, okay? You can do all things through Christ, okay? And with God, all things are possible, people, all right? So be patient and firm. Hallelujah. Praise the most high forevermore, y'all. He always gets all the glory through every situation, amen? His son is so amazing for dying for our sins, y'all. Praise him. He is excellent, y'all. He is a seeking shepherd, the self-existent one, separate from sinners, the servant, the servant of ruler, servant of the Father, servant of the Lord, shade upon thy right hand, shadow of a great rock, shadow of his hand, shadow of my hand, shadow of the Almighty, shadow of thy wings, shalom of God, shekinah, glory, shelter, shelter of his flock, shepherd of Israel, shepherd of souls, shepherd of the flock, shepherd of the little flock, shepherd of the other sheep, shepherd of the sheep, shepherd of tender compassion, shepherd lamb, shepherd of the valley, shield for me, shield of thy help, Shiloh, shorn lamb, Sign spoken against, silent and meek lamb, sin bearer, sinless high priest, sinless one, sir, slayer of the enemy, smith of the nation, smitten judge of Israel, smitten rock of Horeb, smitten shepherd, smitten of God, son of man, sower of the word of God, spirit of Christ, song of drunkards, son from heaven, son of David, son of freedom, son of God, son of Joseph, son of man in heaven, son of man, the savior, son of Mary, son of peace, son of the father, son of the free woman, son of the highest, son of the living God, son of truth, son over his house, spiritual drink, spiritual meat, spiritual rock, spoiler of the principalities, spokesman of the father, sprinkler of nations and kings, star out of Jacob, stay, still of the raging sea, stone cut without hands, stone of Israel, stone of stumbling, stone of builders rejected, stranger and alien, strength and song, strength in time of trouble, Strength of Israel, strength of my heart, strength of my life, strength of the children, strength of the Lord, strength to the needy, strength to the poor, stretched out arm, outstretched arm, strong arm, strong habitation, strong hand, strong Lord, strong redeemer, strong power, strong rock, strong hold, strong tower, stumbling stone, son of righteousness, sure, for, sure foundation, sure mercies of David, sure steadfast anchor, surety of a better testament, surety of David, sustainer, sufficient one, sword of thy excellency, tabernacle, tabernacle of God, teacher from God. Teacher of David, teacher of my path, tempest of hail and destroying storm, temple, temple of the city, tender plant, amazing, awesome, excellent, wonderful God, excellence of the kings, testament of prophecy, testator, testimony of the scriptures, that bread, that eternal life, that one from the beginning, that prophet, the rock, that rock, the creator, the everlasting arm, the excellent delight, the glorious honor of thy majesty, the glory of their strength, the grace of God, the highest, the just, the justification of life, the justification of many. The King, the Lord, my hiding place, the Lord, my help and deliverer, the love of God, the man, the manifest life, the mercy of the most high, the mighty of Jacob, the rock of our salvation, the savior, the victory, the savior of upright hearts, the secret of the Lord, the son of the Lord God, the song of Moses, the sower, the straight gate, thine holy one, thresh of wheat and chaff, throne of God's holiness, the song of the lamb, thou Christ, tower of David, tower and fortress, tower of salvation, trample of the young lion and dragon, treader of the angry waves, treader of the high places, treader of the lion and adder. 
treader of the winepress, thy glorious name, thy kindness and marvelous comfort, thy staff and comfort, thy praise, treasure of wisdom, tried stone, triumph Christ, triumph overcomer, triumph lamb, true and faithful witness, true and righteous judge, true bread from heaven, true God and eternal life, true light, true vine, truth, uncorrupted and glorified one, uncomprehendable light, undefiled, Unknown God, unspeakable gift, upholder of all things, upholding right hand, valiant right hand, veil to a new living way, very beautiful king, very Christ, very foundation of the church, very God of peace, very great, very high, very high priest, very high servant, very lovely song, very present help, very pure word, victorious king and Lord, victorious Lord Jesus, victorious one, victory, vine, voice of great thunder, voice of many waters, voice of the almighty, voice of the Lord God, wall of fire, water of life, way, way everlasting, way of salvation, way of the just, way of the Lord, way to the holiest, weakness of God, well-beloved of God, well-beloved son, white linen of the saints, white stone, wisdom, wisdom and knowledge, wisdom of the just, wise and strong lamb, witness, witness of the father, witness of truth, witness to the people, wonderful counselor, word, word made flesh, word of God, word of his power, word of life, word of righteousness, word of the Lord, worshipful Lord, worthy lamb of heaven, Worthy Lord Jesus, worthy Redeemer, worthy servant, wounded one in house of friends, wounded one, in, wounded one for transgressors, yoke of peace and rest. Young child, zeal the Lord of hosts, zealous one, hallelujah, amen, y'all. Serve a mighty God, y'all, praise him forever, all right? Most definitely, y'all, so there you have it, okay, that's the commentary. What I love to do as I close out is give y'all a priestly blessing on the way out, all right? So here we go. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel, and I will bless them. Shalom. Amen. Selah. Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. Love you all. Praying for you all. Peace. <laughs>